Graphene is unrivaled in its unique physical and electrical properties and has the potential to revolutionise almost every industry. But manufacturing pristine flat graphene is a challenge. Understanding the process that causes graphene to wrinkle will ultimately lead to higher performance devices. In their communication in advanced materials, Professor Rodney Ruoff and colleagues from the Institute for Basic Science and Ulsan National Institute of Science and Technology in the Republic of Korea demonstrate wrinkle-free graphene grown on copper 111 foils. Our ability to make single crystal copper foils, and actually we can make them much larger, has led to growth of large area graphene that doesn't have any wrinkles in it. This has many implications for future uses of graphene. We found high potential graphene grown on copper 111 foils is free of wrinkles and under compressive strain. Epitaxial graphene on a copper 111 substrate shows a much higher compressive strain than non epitaxial graphene on polycrystalline copper. The strain relaxation through the formation of wrinkles is found only in the graphene regions which are not epitaxial with the underlying copper 111 surface. The G band frequency and full width at half maximum from the epitaxial graphene on copper is much higher than for non epitaxial graphene regions. So to form wrinkle in the graphene, part of the graphene has to lift off from the substrate. So the hitching between the graphene and the substrate is very important. And also during the formation process of the wrinkle, part of the graphene has to slide on the substrate. And therefore the friction between the graphene and the substrate must be considered. Density functional theory calculations show that a large frictional force between the graphene and the copper 111 substrate results in a notable energy barrier that inhibits the formation of wrinkles in the epitaxial graphene. This finding may shed light on producing wrinkle-free graphene for use in electronic devices. To find out more about wrinkle-free graphene on a copper 111 surface, please visit the Advanced Materials homepage.